Prisoners are some of the only people left in the world who watch their TV through a 23-channel cable package and watch the local news every night. One night while I was still inside, I was on the phone, and I told my buddy, hey, I gotta go, Walking Dead's starting. And he was like, what do you mean it's starting? Like, why don't you just pause it? And until I got out last year, I didn't understand that literally everybody watches streaming services. Like, I would still think we had TiVo. So eventually the prison system will have to catch up or just stop offering TV altogether. But I'm sure the cable companies want to stay alive and spend a lot of money on lobbying to make sure prisons keep having cable contracts. Additionally, there'd be a bandwidth issue. Because you're talking about like 1,000, 1,200, or one institution has 3,000 people. If everybody's streaming at the same time, you're going to need some hellacious internet connection. But it is kind of cool because I know some of the services are like, you can use up to five screens at one time. So like, what kind of discount do you get when you have like 3,000 people using it at once? Instead, they'll probably start using the tablets, which are little, like, decommissioned phones they sell through JPay, and they'll actually allow you to download shows and download movies onto those, and they'll just charge you a crazy fee, and you just won't be able to watch live TV.